Welcome guys back to another video. My name of course is Malakai Plays, as you already may know, and today we have another Madden 25 connected franchise mode here with the Seattle Seahawks playing against our big division rivals, San Francisco 49ers. Colin Kaepernick comes in this game with par average stats, not the greatest stats, but he would like to give this team a W in a big, big divisional rival matchup. So to begin the game, guys, they handed off to Marcus Lattimore. For some reason, Frank Gore was not in this game. I'm assuming he was injured, so I did not check it, unfortunately, but that's what I assume. Here's the second in inches. They're on their own, 42. Colin Kaepernick's handing off to Lattimore, and he's getting stuffed behind the line for a two-yard loss. Third and two on their own, 40 now. Colin Kaepernick snaps the ball, gives it off to Lattimore again, and gets smacked behind the line with another two-yard loss. As you can see, Russell Wilson's stats are ten times better than Colin Kaepernick's as you could see. Anyways, we're moving on to our very first drive. Marshawn Lynch is pumping it up in the middle, getting a nice first down with 11 yards picked up on that play. Second and seven, Wilson drops back to pass, gives it over to Ricardo Lockett. He receives the first down in his first catch of the game for 12 yards. Lynch runs the ball out to the right, getting a nice gain there, gets about nine yards on that play. Here we are on a second and inches, trying to move down the field. Hopefully, he can score a touchdown or a field goal. Once again, giving it over to Ricardo Lockett with his second reception of the gay day. He gets another first down for us. Great play there. We give it off to Lynch here with the second and inches, moving up the field, trying to drive down the field. Hopefully, we can capitalize, guys, and score a touchdown. Wilson drops back to pass, throws over to Lockett, and he drops the ball. Unfortunately, guys, he did drop the ball. Which I was kind of surprised, but at the same time, who knows. Anyways, we give it off to Decker. We throw it over to him, and he does score the touchdown. An amazing play, Eric Decker, to get open, just run the little slant route type of route, and just get a touchdown. Good play there by Eric Decker. So like I said, guys, he was such a great pickup for us. I really am proud to have Eric Decker on our team. He's a great pickup, and why not? So here's the first and 10. They're on their own 31. Kaepernick's handed it off to Lattimore, and he's not going anywhere. The run game is really not working for them. I was really surprised to see them continue to run the ball. But here's a screen, something a little different, but it's not going to work out at all. Only three passes by Kaepernick. As you can tell, they have been running the ball a lot, and we have been too. But we have been capitalizing and going for successful yards. So here we go to a third and five on our own 49. Russell Wilson drops back, passes it over the heart, and boom, the hit that he got laid out on right there was a huge hit. And Marshawn Lynch is coming out now with the running play and gets about nine yards on that play. So a third and one here on their 35, giving it off to the beast, getting a first down once again. Nine yards on that play. His stats already an amazing game so far. Wilson drops back. We threw in the screen. And unfortunately, I run right into James Carpenter. I believe that is number 77. Could be Bowie. It could be another one. We have a lot of offensive line that all has 70 numbers. But we do settle for the field goal, guys. Unfortunately, but it's all good. We're going to go ahead and, you know, try to capitalize on those touchdowns and hopefully win this game. So here's a first and 10. Throwing it over to Hampton from Colin Kaepernick. Sherman's going to get the tackle on the play. 13 yards are picked up before the tackle. First and 15, and Lattimore once again going none, nowhere. A five-yard loss there. Second and 20 on their own 26. Handing off to Lattimore again. This one's the best run he's had all day, and he's going to get about 25 yards, 24 yards on that play. So here they are, 48-yard line, and boom, he gets sacked. Bruce Irvin comes up with a sack there. Third and 17 on their own 45. Kaepernick's dropping back to pass. He's trying to find somebody open. He can't find anybody open. I go ahead, take over Thurman, and just slam him in the back. He gets sacked. If you get it that much time and nobody's open, there's something they need to do differently. So here's the punt. Harvin's returning. He's going out to the right. He's going to get a nice gain here. Obviously, it wasn't a big game. We didn't get to the 20. I could have went ahead and just let it bounce the end zone, but I decided to go for it. Anyways, Wilson drops back to pass, throws it deep to Lockett, and Ricardo Lockett is going to pick up the first down. Beautiful throw and play by Ricardo Lockett, being able to go right in front of the defenders, face the safety's eyes, and just pick up a nice catch. So we're moving on third and eight on their 45. 
hopefully we can get a touchdown or a field goal. That was all I was really looking forward, and we get even more. A first down thrown to Golden Tate, beautiful throw. But unfortunately, guys, we do wind up settling for a field goal. So that was decent. I'm not really mad about it. We got points on the board. Regardless, it's a good play for us because we did get points on the board. So here we are, the end of the first half, guys. The stats are pretty decent here for us. We did a decent job on passing and rushing. I think we just got to capitalize on those touchdowns, and that's something that we need to do more of because we would have 21 points if we capitalize on touchdowns. Here's a beautiful throw to Lockett, and he's hurt, guys. I just cannot believe it. Ricardo Lockett comes in. I, I basically took him off the bench and pretty much substituted some other guy just to give him a chance. So Tate will come in for him. And as you can see, a torn hamstring. He's gone for the year, basically. Basically, he's going to be gone for about 10 weeks. That's a big, big loss, especially with the way he's been playing the past two weeks. He's been phenomenal. In the Saints game we just had in the first half, he had, he had three touchdown catches in that game. And to have him... To lose him now kind of sucks, but the thing is we have Percy Harvin who can pick out the load even though Ricardo Lockett is gone, and I was really wanting to establish him in my offense, but it's obviously probably not going to happen. Marcus Lattimore running out to the right from his own 22, going downfield, another beautiful run. I feel like that was the only thing that we messed up on during this whole game is giving up big runs when really we were dominating the run game the whole entire game and then we would just give up those lousy big runs so here's a third and 18 Colin Kaepernick dropping back to pass it's an incomplete pass Sherman almost picks it off he knows it he's like man I almost beat that mediocre <laughs> I was just saying that as a joke guys I I thought it was a decent thing even though Richard Sherman did say the mediocre receiver with Crabtree regardless Sherman has the stats to back it up and I think he's the best corner in the game in the NFL right now so Ford Ninjas here, guys, we're on our own, we're on our own 48. We're gonna go ahead and go for it. Running it up to Turbin. He's just gonna go for the first down, and he does get that indeed. Gets his first rush of the game. So we move on to the 17-yard line of the 49ers. Handed throwing it over to Lynch. Lynch is gonna get a pick up a good yardage right there, about nine yards on the play. So we go to a second and goal. Wilson's running out to the right. He's running out to the right, trying to find somebody open, but he's not going to find anybody. He's going to go for the end zone, and he gets into the end zone for the touchdown. Great elusiveness by Russell Wilson to see. Nothing is going on there to just go out to the right, move out to the right, move from the left to the right, and just score the touchdown. Beautiful play. As you can see, the 49ers are really falling apart in this game, and especially in a huge game as this is a big divisional rival matchup to dictate who will win the division as the Niners obviously need to get something going before it's too late, and it might be just too late. Six minutes remain in this game, guys. Fourth quarter, throwing out deep to Sherman, and he's going to intercept the ball right in front of Crabtree's face. Beautiful play by Sherman to just intercept the ball from Colin Kaepernick. Unfortunately, Colin Kaepernick is just not playing so well in this game. He's really throwing bad plays, not doing the greatest, especially at the end of this game. And that's not what you need to do if you want to win this game. So we are up 27 to nothing. We're on their 37. We're handing it off to Lynch. Beast Mode's going up. And he jumped over a player, guys. He got over the player. Elevated up in the air. Beautiful play by Marshawn Lynch. Gets a nice 9-yard gain. Here's Durbin. He's trying to do the same thing. He's just trying to do deja vu of what happened with his... Starting running back of Marshawn Lynch. We settle for the field goal once again. I feel like it, if there's one thing we need to work on, it stops settling for field goals. But we would like to get a, sh a shutout right now, guys. It is 30 to nothing. We hope to do something on this defensive drive, and they get a nice pass there. They're doing a no huddle. Basically, they didn't do anything. But here is a play that really changed the game. If, if, if they make that play to Anquan Bolton, it's a good first down, and who knows if the, the shutout does last. So we're basically just running down the clock, and that's pretty much basically it. That's all all she wrote. We're going to win this game 30 to nothing, a big divisional rival matchup, and our first time winning in Candlestick in over four years, I believe it is, as the curse has been broken, and we will move on to Levi Stadium next year. 
30 to nothing guys we go to the sea go on the season 12 and 1 on the season with three games remaining we pretty much have the division and we pretty much have everything in our favor we just gotta be clutch and win the rest of the games thanks guys for watching my name of course is malachi please as you already may know and i will see you in the next episode which should be very very soon i hope you did enjoy this because I love doing these, and they're a lot of fun, and I'm going to continue do them, doing them, and I'm going to add more series as well in the near future. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.